Hey everyone, Kaiser, and welcome back to the Simpsons Tapped Out. Back at it in this golfing update, and I've actually finished the first act already. Keep in mind there are four acts, three more to go. What I'm actually going to be doing is I'm going to the June History Mystery Box, because you can see in the top right, one free token available every act, so four free tokens that are available. Lobster Island, which is the yearbook mystery box, Citizen Solar, and Windland, they are finally returning. It's been a very, very long time. I know they were part of a couple of superhero updates. And then we've got a building pack as well. They were craftable items back in the day. I think during the superhero update as well, so you can get duplicates. I'm pretty sure I've already gotten it in the past. So the one I really want to go for is the middle one. Here we go. I had a 33% chance, I guess, in that range. And I got Citizen Solar and Windlad. I know a lot of people have been wanting this to return, and it finally does. Hello? Hey, it's what's her face? It's too cloudy. Citizen Solar. It's just not Springfield without insert name here. People don't like the noise I make. Windlad. And I finally completed the superheroes updates. Or well, one of them anyways. I'm guessing these are probably two separate characters. So we're gonna get two quest lines, I'm guessing. Which means this could be a very long video. Voice? I feel like you have a voice. I feel they both have a voice. It's too cloudy. You know what, Winlad? I've been feeling pretty dandy lately. The sun's been shining bright, and I'm as cranked up as a Tesla supercharger. I'm feeling great too. I'm spinning faster than a Category 6 tornado, Alley Twister. If these weather patterns keep up, we may no longer be second-rate heroes. Oh yeah, that's right, they have to rely on Mother Nature. So they're actually together. I wasn't sure if they would be separate, but it looks like they are together, at least in the quest line. Bathe in sun, dance in the wind. It's too cloudy. First up, bathe in the sun. Whoa. Yeah, I guess that would make sense because he needs the sun for the solar power. I would just expect him to be in like a lawn chair and just kind of chilling. Man, that's bright. Well, there's that. Let's see if... People don't like the noise I make. Hey, you have a voice too, Dance in the Wind? Yeah. Well, I mean, obviously they don't have superpowers. So wait, what does the sun guy do? I don't remember. If it's charging, like the, the soul power, the soul panel, what are his powers, so to speak? Maybe that's what it is. It blinds people. I've never enjoyed the blazing scorching unbearable sun more. There hasn't been a more hot air blowing since the last GOP debate. Right? It's too cloudy. Citizen Solar, what happens if the weather stops being so great for us? We become nobodies again. Dust in the wind, wind lad. Maybe if we study the weather, we'll be able to forecast low wind and poor UV light. Then, if the weather takes a turn for the worse, we can just go into hiding. Excellent idea, wind lad. To the books we go. Well, that's boring. I found some disturbing news about our new strength, wind lad. Me too, Citizen Solar. Well, what is it? Bad weather pattern? It's too cloudy. The reason my power has been so great lately is due to the thinning ozone layers. More UV rays are shining into the planet, hence a boost to my solar power. The higher average temperature increase has caused more storms and turbulence in the atmosphere. Both of us are benefiting from the effects of climate change. The only way we're going to stay strong is if people keep using fossil fuels. It's too cloudy. It's great again, I guess. Off you go. 
people don't like the noise I make. <clears throat> what are you guys doing? You know the effects of climate change. Exactly. If the Earth is warming, how does Santa Claus still get around? We use oil for the things we love. We put it in our salads, in our cars, and to cure squeaks. Neither of those points make sense. It's too cloudy. I can't keep letting Windlad and Citizen Solo go around spouting this nonsense. They're supposed to be supporters of clean energy. Windlad did make a good point though. Santa still visits Springfield every year. And the earth warming up is good for lots of wonderful things. Palm trees, swimming pools, road runners, scorpions. Ugh. Scorpions, huh? It's too cloudy. Windland, Citizen Solar, you can't support fossil fuels anymore. I know you think it makes you guys stronger, but you don't need to be stronger. Renewable energy isn't meant to be more powerful than fossil fuels, it's meant to outlast them. But how are we supposed to beat our enemies? That's my point. You don't need to beat them. You're going to outlast them. Huh. I guess that is kind of true. Generate renewable energy and blast off. So we're going to probably get both. And second, final animations. It's too cloudy. The 24 hour quest. Well, you're not looking so good. People don't like the noise I make. Eh. Alright, so we got both of them. Oh my goodness, he's flying! Wait, what was the actual... What was the quest for that guy? The wind dude? Always oh, blast out, that's what it was. I like the fact that it's just side by side like that. It makes it easier, you know? Can fit it all on one frame. So yeah, I guess that's probably the end of the quest line. I haven't actually tapped it where it says, you know, the final quest or whatever, but we're on the fifth part, and normally back in the day, there were five parts. If it's a little bit longer, well, I mean, it is what it is. We've seen both of the animations as well, which is the important thing. Let me know down below, though, which animations did you like better? Did you like the solar guy, or did you like the wind guy? I'm very, very curious. Also, it makes me wonder how many characters I'm actually missing as well, in terms of, like, premium characters. Not ones that cost real money, but just premium characters in general. I assume I'm probably pretty close to getting all of them. So guys for more tap down videos and I will see you with more in this Goblin Updates in the Simpsons Tap Down. So thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next week. Bye everybody.